Okay. 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 Stop, Rob. Do you have anything to say? So here's the thing with me. I'm, I'm not really a Playboy Cardi fan. I don't know if that I'm gonna get too much hate in the comments. So I don't really know his vibe or his music as much. So I'm a little bit confused on what this is. That was putting it lightly. You know, there's so many different sounds of music. There's country music, even the XXX Tentacions of the world. Of, look at me, look at me, look. Like, I feel like I can find, oh, I can see why that appeals to a, a certain audience. I can see why country music appeals. I can see why uh, this, the screamo, this, screamo, eh. What? Sorry. <laughs> what the f Like, okay, Playboy Cardi clearly has a fan base. Someone's downloading me this. I've heard some songs with Playboy Cardi and it sounded cool, but then I've heard some where I didn't really, wasn't really my vibe. I think my main thing with this is like, just, I'm just basing it off of the performance. What was that? That is so I feel like the performance aspect has to be a big part of it, right? Well, yeah, you're a performer. And not only did he lip sync the whole time. And just, not even lip sync. And not even lip sync. Yeah, you better he was just hopping up and down with the two punk punk guys on the side not doing anything. And I don't want to roast it. <laughs> because I'm he's obviously more successful than I am. Put me on the stage. I can do a couple moves or be more entertaining than that. I didn't get the whole not even saying anything while the thing was playing. Mm-hmm. It was like, wait, is he even supposed to? Because then at that point, right, just play the song. You don't have to be. You have to be there. Maybe like you don't even have to fake holding up, hold up the microphone, right? Like if if you if if it's playing never too much, uh, uh, never too much, and you're just going like this, you might just dance to your music at that point. But then again, it's like okay, if you're trying to see like I don't know what what it takes to be an actual artist like that. I don't know what he's going through. I mean, to be on stage, maybe like the audience just want to see the, the the artist on stage moving around and grooving or something. And. I could, I have it downloaded. Yeah. That one's good. I'm a Cardi fan. But there's, there's this, and then there's. Are we haters? I mean, I don't think we're haters. I think we're very analytical. I mean, he's, I'm sure he's a great guy. Iggy Looking wouldn't at say the, that. I don't know. What I'm trying to do, my goal is to make a song and perform. And I can take no we can take notes, Ryan. Think about that. Yeah, what about Playboy Cardi do people like so much? We take notes. We're like, okay, we don't want to look like that, right? On stage. And so we can do the opposite or do maybe you learn, live and learn. And we also talked about this too. We, we said that I think Lil Uzi started it, making a caption and then adding the extra unnecessary asterisks and stars and emojis and like that's a whole aesthetic that these artists like put on big font, capital lowercase, dot, 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 plus sign. Oh, Ryan, you're being a hater, dude. I love Playboy Cardi. Okay. <laughs> you're allowed to. Hey. I think everyone's entitled to their own opinion. Oh, Playboy Cardi is hot right now, right? He just released his new album or something. Mm -hmm. Something three years or something. Like I said, I have never really been a Playboy Cardi fan. I've also haven't been a fan of a lot of rappers, so. <laughs> this is just an interesting, this didn't blow him up. It was the uh, it was the older him that blew him up. Now he does stuff like this. Um, so do you think he wants to do stuff like this, or are they making him do stuff like this? It's not like in New York I'm Millie Rock. Now it's like, uh, and the way it was edited together. I listened to a few songs. So I've seen different artists progress and do different things, and they sign with the label, then they start doing you know different sounds and whatnot. Do you think Playboy Cardi is on the incline or decline? The f amount of people that were Cardi this, Cardi that, when he was about to drop the album, clearly he has a huge, like he was going up. Didn't all the songs leak and everyone found all something, the songs they thing before he even did like- Something like that. People were waiting for this. I, I think, know we're gonna get a lot of people in the comments, but hopefully you guys can see what, what we're coming but from. But it's also an ongoing joke that this was terrible, that the album was terrible. Oh, really? Like, everyone was like, what is this? See, that's how much I know about it. Like, I don't even know anything about it, so. And then some people, uh, we need to listen to it a few times. <laughs> well, yeah, if you listen closely, I... there was one song. That you was... need to listen to an yeah. album. Albums age over years, not over minutes or time. Because I think if you're a hardcore Playboy Cardi fan or hardcore anybody, any artist fan, it's hard to accept the fact that maybe that was that project wasn't good. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? <laughs> and I'm a like I'm a, the biggest Drake fan on the planet. Drake has a lot of songs that I don't like. Mm -hmm. And that's okay. And it's okay. And he has something to do. I'm sure you don't like all the videos we post, but I'm sure you like a handful of them. <laughs> yeah, it's facts. Okay. Normalize having your own opinion. <gasps> I just said it. 
if somebody has a taste in something that isn't the same as yours, it's okay. <laughs> oh. Oh, I shouldn't have said it. I shouldn't have said that. Never too much. Hey, uh, never too much. Like, dude. What geek don't was like this guy? Honestly, this guy. <laughs> the Liberty Spikes? And them just there, like, this was him. Look at him, look at him. I really hired that guy to sit there and just yeah, look so weird. So Playboy Cardi performance. We're looking to have some <laughs> background dancers. They were like, wait, Playboy's performing. We don't have anything set up. We got some backstage boxes. We have no choreography. Just, just stand and bob just your head. Down. And Playboy, how many effects do you want on stage? Put yes. Rest up, me. Dude, throw every effect. Everything. Because my song, to be honest, is not that good. So <laughs> just anything to distract it would be perfect. If you can do like the strobe, like black, white, black, like so like, you can't even see me. It might not even be him, who knows? Fuck it, get the stunt double. I ain't gonna be there. I'm supposed to, Iggy's mad at me because I gotta go. He's probably mm. watching his kid right now. Ooh, my kid. Bro, but the, the head bobbers just stand at. Yeah, play their part of me. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> they just hired some random two dudes off the street. Uh, you. Um, you. <laughs> Come here. It's an easy job, I swear. Just, just go, just go, like, just do this the whole time. And then go down a little bit. And it stand up. Well, you need to listen to it a bunch of times because it, I heard it. He said never too much 50 times. <laughs> but it's never too much. It is too much. <laughs> Sometimes it is too much. Okay, Playboy. Mr. Cardi, it's too much. And here's the thing. We're saying all this stuff. We're not the all-knowing beings. We're not the best. This is just giving you guys our opinion. To be honest, we kind of analyze things like this a lot. So maybe we should do more content like this where we watch a video and just kind of like give our opinion on it. That could be kind of funny or maybe you guys may think the same way. Never too much. Let us know if you guys want to see more stuff like this. Never too much. Yeah, it's never too much. N not at all.